Hello Pisces, welcome back. So the weekly readings are very popular, so I'm going to keep doing them. Of course, uh, when I can't, I won't be able to every week, but I'm going to try. I just noticed um, King of Pentacles is on the bottom of the deck. So some of you are dealing with uh, most likely a man who is uh, an earth sign, Virgo, Capricorn, or Taurus. But could be any, let me see the, yeah, so something that was very hard on you emotionally and on them as well and six of swords with the nine of cups so they would like to make peace with you so let's see uh we're gonna do this week upcoming week from the 24th of february till uh, March 1st, which is the following weekend, we're going to ask what you're dealing with Pisces and the advice from the universe, how to best handle your situation. Uh, also, of course, we're going to ask your loved one, whoever it is you thinking of while watching this video and whoever it is that has the special spot in your heart, your soulmate. So let's see how you're doing first. Universe, please step in, show very important messages for the sign of Pisces. For Pisces, highest good, please. How is Pisces doing? What's going on with Pisces? The world. So some of you love to travel. World travelers. You have a lot of stress in your life. Currently. Your own energy showed up here. Also, Cancerian energy, moon. A lot of, yeah. So, look at this. Again, the king of pentacles showed up. So, a lot of you are trying to find peace after some kind of breakup with the person that you had in your life that you love. They are showing up as king of pentacles. Could be any sign and either gender. But usually King of Pentacles represents a man who is an earth sign, Virgo, Capricorn, or Taurus. So you have unresolved issues uh, that you feel need to resolve, need to be resolved for you to go on in peace with your life. Uh, the moon card with Ten of Wands. You have a lot of stress. Uh, yeah, let's see. Let's see clarification. More details. We like details. Universe, please step in. Show details. More clarification. What is Pisces dealing with? Yeah. Um, you feel there is no resolution currently. So you have these psychic abilities. You're very uh, intuitive. You're very intuitive when it comes to people and situations. Three of Cups. So some kind of, yeah, you want reunion with this person, to at least to make peace. We're going to, after we do this, we're going to ask how they are doing and if they're thinking of you, what their energies are towards you. So for a lot of you, you either lived with this person, were married to this person, or were heavily in a relationship with this person, and you feel it's not resolved enough for you to go on. You have a lot of unanswered questions. So some of you are dealing with, with this individual, no matter what gender they are or sign they are. A person is stubborn. Also, this... Uh, Energy represents Aries. So some of you are dealing with a stubborn person that could be an Aries that uh, is set in their ways, has a big ego. Seven of Pentacles. So you've been waiting for this individual to reach out to you, uh, for you to talk to them and resolve whatever issues are going on between you two. So a lot of you were living with this person, whether you were married to them or not, you were living with this individual. So looks like they're spying on you. Didn't that show up within your last video? Let me see. One of the signs had, or two of the signs, let me see, hold on. Pisces, yeah. 
So the last reading I did for you, Pisces, the same energy keeps popping up. Look at this. But this time it showed, I can't remember what showed up in your sign last reading I did. But here it shows up, Spycraft card again, uh, Page of Swords with the High Priestess. So they're being undercover. They don't want you to know. So they're wearing a mask. They're very sneaky. They're checking up on you to see how you're doing, what's going on with you in your life. They want to resolve this. They do. So whatever it is that happened between you two that was a uh, cause of a breakup, uh, they want to do the right thing by you. Justice card is a good indicator of good intentions. This also means Libra. Some of you are dealing with the Libra, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. Could be any sign. Also, Aries showed up very strongly. So they would like, they, so they know they owe you apologies. They're checking on you heavily. So they've been watching you for some time now uh, in a sneaky way. They don't want you to know. Uh, let's see what they're dealing with. What's going on with their life? So you have a lot of unanswered questions due to no communication with the person that you love still. Let's see how they're doing. Universe, please step in. Show very important messages collectively for the sign of Pisces. For Pisces, highest good, please. Universe, please show the sign of Pisces. How is their soulmate, no matter what sign they are or what gender they are, how is the Pisces soulmate uh, doing? What's going on in their life? What is going on in the soulmate's life? What kind of energies they dealing with and are they thinking, of course they are, are they thinking of Pisces? Yeah, so a lot of them, no matter what sign they are or gender they are, uh, a lot of them are very emotional, emotionally withdrawn, very guarded with their heart. They're trying to be logical, objective like a judge, uh, make wise decisions. So they are thinking of you. This means thinking a lot, especially since this showed up in position one. Yeah, so they realize that in the recent past with the tower card here, something was very unbalanced and toxic between the two of you. And that's why the two of you had to go separate ways. I'm curious to see what the next two cards will be. Wow. So you love this person. You still love this person. Queen of Cups. And they know. Again, the moon card. So you not they're not sure what's going to happen. They're very uncertain. But they know one thing for sure. There has to be a resolution to this. So they keep thinking about you heavily. Let's see clarification. They would like to reconcile, not necessarily to be together, but to have peace between you two and then decide what the two of you want to do. They, yeah, look at this. The tower with five of cups. So they have regrets of the mistakes that were made, whether it was by them or you or both of you, they have a lot of regrets. They feel sadness, remorse. They feel very sad about the way things happen. You look at this. So you have the tower card twice from two different decks. The tower card twice. So you have been shaken up by the way they left. So in a lot of cases, this person left you and you've been shocked by the way they exited your life but nevertheless you still feel love for them emotions for them and you are confused on how to go on with your life because you have no resolution but here with the world card it shows that a lot of you have balanced your karmic cycles with this person so even though you suffered emotionally and they suffered emotionally and it shows both of you did because the tower card shows up twice. And here they are showing us sad, depressed, and regretful. You didn't suffer in vain. You have learned lessons from each other. 
let's see more clarification how they doing so they're trying to figure out how to handle this what to do so it's like a waiting game for them to figure out should they step forward should they contact you if they do what should they say so they see you as this grounded energy they see you as somebody who's independent financially who doesn't need anyone to support them or be them for them be there for them emotionally or financially they see you as wife material self-reliant self-sufficient independent so they would like to yeah look at this look at this the judgment which is reconciliation their plan is to slowly re-enter your life and make some kind of peace with you whether the two of you like to reconcile or uh, stay friends be on peaceful grounds together they recognize that there needs to be some kind of resolution some kind of peace they very regretful sad and depressed emotionally because of how things happened so they would like a resolution to this so it looks like they learning they are learning if they didn't appreciate you before they are starting to appreciate you now so we're going to go into the extended read we're going to ask how they are currently towards you their true intentions and plans currently anything they may be withholding now that the universe feels you should be aware of for your highest good at this time and based on the energies that show up we're going to ask at the very end advice for you in this situation at the moment for your highest good so pisces i want to thank you so much for joining me click on the extended read link below this video in the description box below and i'll see you there sending you big hugs